issues in machine learning the issues in machine learning are presented in the form of questions for general target functions which algorithm we need to use if sufficient training data is given what setting are needed for algorithm to arrive at a specific result which algorithms performs best for which type of problems and representations the algorithm will perform best how much training data is sufficient how much training experience is sufficient how much experiences does a learner needs to generalize the problems can prior knowledge be helpful even when it is only approximately correct what is the best strategy for choosing a useful next training experience what is the best way to reduce the learning task what specific function should the system attempt to learn can this process itself be automated how can the learner automatically alter its representation to improve its ability to represent and learn the target function for these questions there is no specific or exact answer available in machine learning that's why these questions becomes the issues in machine learning for every training example there may be a specific function finding out general function that can be applicable to all training example is the main issue of machine learning concept learning concept learning is acquiring the definitions of a general category from given sample positive and negative training example of the category it means that we need a definition of a general category which can be applicable to positive samples also and negative training examples also it is seen as a problem of searching for the hypothesis that best fits the training example the hypothesis space has general to specific ordering of hypothesis means for every training example we can find out a hypothesis for the entire training space we may get the hypothesis space which consist of h1 h2 h3 and all it is represented in the form of capital h so capital h is h1 h2 h3 and so on to find out a general hypothesis from the hypothesis space is a tedious task a formal definition for concept learning is inferring a boolean valued function from training examples of its input and output we are finding out a boolean valued function it may be true or false correct or wrong yes or no so everything is a boolean valued function if you remember the example we have taken in program 1 the last column in the training sample is represented as a concept the concept will give you whether the attribute values considered is true or false an example for concept learning is the learning of bird concept from the given examples of birds and non birds here birds are considered as positive examples and non birds are considered as negative examples our job is to find out whether the given bird is a bird or not we are trying to learn the definition of a concept from the given examples we will consider a concept learning task that is enjoy sport training example look at the table the table consist of four training examples those are row 1 row 2 row 3 and row 4 the column names will represent the attribute names and corresponding values are attribute values the last column will represent the concept a set of example days and each is described by six attributes they are sky air temperature humidity wind water 
and forecast the task is to learn to predict the value of enjoy sport for a arbitrary day based on the values of its attribute values the table will represent whether a person will enjoy the sport on a particular day or not training sample 1 on that day the sky is sunny air temperature is warm humidity is normal wind is strong water is warm and forecast is same in this condition the person will enjoy the sport if you look at the third row then it will represent it is a rainy sky air temperature is cold humidity is high wind is strong water is warm and forecast is change if this is the case then that person won't enjoy the sport 